Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Frost Survival Iron Man Mode. So, we're currently at Oberlin Station, and we're actually... Thanks. Um, we're actually not in a bad place at the moment. Um, we've got ourselves medical supplies, we've got food and water. Um, so what we need now is shelter. Because... Um, as good as the water treatment plant is, and, you know, we've cleared it out, so it's pretty safe, there's no beds there, which is the next thing we're going to need if we want to survive an entire day. Um, which leaves us with a few decisions to make. Well, one decision to make, which is where do we want to go? Um, our safest bet would probably be going up north and trying to find somewhere, you know, like Sanctuary or, um... Or is it Starlight Drive-In? You know, somewhere like that. Somewhere we can set up a workshop without needing to kill too many things. Which I guess is the best bet. Our other option is going to, like, Arcjet, which doesn't have a bed, but it has workshops at least. Um, or trying to go to College Square, or something like that. Uh, but I think probably we should head north. Maybe try for Starlight Drive-In. Um, since we do have the generator schematic, we can actually um, maybe get a water purifier set up if we're lucky, although we'll probably need more gear before we can pull that off. Uh-oh. There's that dog. I was wondering when he would show up. Alright, we're going to have to be careful around that. Okay, we might just try and get rid of this dog. Um, might try and snipe it. Shit. Extra shit. Run away. Run, 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 run. Holy shit. That was... That was close. Okay, but we leveled up, which is good. I don't know why I'm scrolling over here, because there's nothing over here. I'm more impressed that we didn't die instantly when that dog bit us, I guess. We've got... Decent endurance? I don't know. Either way, we should take Hunter... So that we can get a steadier supply of food. And we should also heal our limb. Oh no, I always forget if Stimpaks heal limbs in Frost. Ah, crap. Well, I guess it's worth a shot. We don't have a surgical kit, so. Stimpak, flood water. That did not heal our leg. Well, shit, we gotta. Oh no, it did. Okay, cool. We're good. We don't have a Stimpak anymore, but. Such is life. Oh, yeah, we've picked up uh, we've picked up our first tier of tiredness. All right, let's take a quick look inside this bus. See if we can't find ourselves, you know, some Nuka Cola or something that can keep us awake while we travel. Clean black suit. Uh, no, not not really what we're looking for there. We can also check out these Pulaski shelters. Pulaski, Pulaski, Pulaski. Nope, nothing in there. Nope. Empty cooler, of course. Nope. Nope. Let's stop playing the thing every time I open this. A pompadour wig. Is that just like a charisma buff? Or, yeah, it's a charisma buff. Okay. Well, that's not really something that we need. These usually don't work. Yeah, no. Oh, well. On we actually hang on, there's a wooden crate over there. Might have stuff in it. And the answer is a clipboard. Cool. Alright, well, off we go, I suppose. Nope. You stay back. Jesus Christ. Fucking angry ass deer. Oh, I'm using so many of my pistol bullets because I keep missing. Ugh. I think someone's shooting at me. From really far away. Like, I think there's someone up on top of Corvega firing at me. We're gonna we're gonna hustle a little bit. We're also gonna stop to check this box, which is empty. Cool. Back to hustling. Okay. There don't seem to be any more bullets headed my way. So I think we're all right. 
the game apparently disagrees with me. Okay. Okay, we're in, we're in the clear now, I guess. Oh, cool. Does he have friends? He does have friends. Hmm. One ghoul I can take pretty easily. Two ghouls is something to worry about, though. I don't really want to waste any more of my precious ammo that I've been spending really stupidly. So why don't we just try and sneak past him? We're almost to our destination. All right. Here we are now. We just need to make sure it's clear and make our way to the workshop, which I just realized the door is locked and I don't have a bobby pin, I don't think. Crap. Do I have a bobby pin? I don't have a bobby pin. Ah, Jesus. Uh, I think we can still interact with the workshop if we look in through the window. There's going to be a lot of this place is going to be kind of inaccessible. So, get our handy dandy rifle out and take a look around here. What enemies are there? It's a tree trunk. I don't see anything. It's probably mole rats. It's always mole rats. No, I still don't see anything, which is a little bit concerning. I'm worried that something's going to jump out at me. Oh, there we go. Oh. Hello. I mean, they can't get me up here, but now they're giant rats. So that's good. Can you hold still so I can shoot you? No, you're just gonna run away? I mean, that's fine too, I suppose. Um, not really, I do kinda need to kill those things. Yep. Oop. Get up on the car. Ah, crud. This is going to be a pain to deal with. Get back here. They are not okay. They are surprisingly tough. Oh! Yeah, I see ya. I don't really want to waste any more, like, pistol ammo on this. But there are a fair few of them, so might actually be in my best interest to just shoot some of them in the face. Yeah, you better run. That's right, I can kill rats. Bow down before your god. Rad rat meat. Cool. Just what I always wanted. Alright, where did they go? Where did they go? Come on. Yeah, I see you there. Come here. the other one. Come on, I know there's another one here. At least they make a lot of noise while they're running. Where is the other one? This is concerning. Okay, let's just try and get to the workshop. Oh shit, that's a ghoul. Well, come at me then. Come on, I know you see me. Come on. Dick. Okay, anyone else? No? Alright, I think we're okay. Now, can we... Out of bobby pins. Yeah, that's locked. Can we reach the workshop in some way? Uh, if we can't, we might have to move somewhere else. Which would be unfortunate. Although I guess somewhere else might not have a rogue rat running around somewhere. Which would be good. Nope, definitely can't reach that. Okay. Uh, look around for a bobby pin, I guess. Shit! I thought that was an active. Alright, so here's our next character. We somehow started with pretty much the same clothes as the last one, although a little bit less armor. 
And we are at the Na what was it? Nahunt Nahunt Oceanological Survey place, which seems to be fairly abandoned. Um, let's take a quick look at our gear for the moment. So, we got ourselves an auto pistol again because it's always gotta be an auto pistol. You can't give me a useful one. And we've also got oops, a pool cue, which is not great, but better than an auto pistol. Um, we got all our armor, we got this, we got a little bit of food to start, I guess, and we don't have anything. Oh, we do have a lantern, which is not working. And I'm not entirely sure why. I might have to reinstall that mod. Either way, it's fine, because for the moment it's, you know, the middle of the day, so we don't really need the lantern. Um, but I would like that to be working. And for our stats, um, poor perception and charisma, really good strength. Everything else is... Oh, good strength and luck was the other one that we got. And then the other three stats are fairly average. So why don't we take a quick look around our little starting area here and hopefully not tread on a mine or, you know, get eviscerated by some angry critter. That sounds like meat crabs. Ooh, empty bottle. I will take that. Another empty bottle. Okay. So far, so good. I'm definitely hearing mute crabs, though. I think they're under the... Whoa! Oh, goddammit, another one of those radioactive barnacles. Yeah, I see you down there. What are you gonna do? Jump at me? Get longer legs, shorty. Okay, what's in the rest of this place? There's probably a bunch more mute crabs around that I guess we're gonna have to keep an eye out for. But for now... Damn it, locked. Uh, what about this house? Can we get in here? The windows are boarded up, so this... Ooh. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm dying to poison. Oh, there's nothing I can do about that. There is nothing I can do about that at all. Well, that was that was short-lived. Teach me to taunt mute crabs. Alright, third character for the episode. So, we are right outside... Nowhere. We are right outside the uh, customs house, I think. And there are a few people nearby. So we're going to be in sneak mode for a bit, but let's take a quick look at our equipment and stats. So, we got ourselves a pipe revolver rifle and a sledgehammer, which is absurdly heavy, but I did kind of needed a melee weapon, so, you know, I'm okay with it for now. We'll find a better one at some point, or we'll die. Um, we've actually got decent armor on everything except our right arm, and not a lot of, you know, medical supplies or anything. So, yeah, that's about that. Why don't we try and get out of here? I don't really like where we are at the moment. Actually, I guess we could go try and check out the inside of the customs house. Could be full of ghouls or something, but what's the worst that can happen, really? Alright, here goes nothing. Wow, that loaded surprisingly quickly. Uh, there's a lot of dead people in here. And this place is probably going to be full of ghouls, which is just peachy. Or mines, or both. What do we got? Nothing in the Aha! Stim back in a surgical scalpel, though. That's good. Well, I guess we'll take a look around. Trash can, no. Actually, wait. All the doors seem to be, like, completely blocked up. Yeah, that's not a door I'm opening anytime soon, even with a sledgehammer. Okay. So... I mean, this is nice and all, but is there anything behind the desk, maybe? Nope. Okay. Alright, well, uh, this concludes our tour of the customs house. So where are we going on? Woo! Oh, cripes, there's people over there. Alright, we're out of here. We are out of here super quick. Let's get going. Uh, find somewhere far away from the people with guns.
bullets for a minigun. Great. Three of them. Well, if we find a minigun, we will be able to fire it up for a whole almost not quite a second. Fantastic. There's a dead person up there. And I'm concerned because I don't see what killed him. But I do want to loot him for stuff. So we're going to go over there. Board. Ah, backpack. I will take that. Federation fatigues. Eh, hmm. Actually. Yeah, nah. We're gonna we're gonna leave those. We are going to put on this backpack though. There we go. Well, 15 extra carry capacity. That's pretty nice. And I suppose we'll look around some more. Probably not a very good idea, but we're gonna do it anyways. Anybody home? Ghouls. Oh, it's always ghouls. It's a lot of ghouls. And oh, did they spot me? I think they spotted me. Hello. I don't know that they can reach me, but I think we should get out of here. Oh, cripes. Cripes. Ah, I'm very slowly dying. Well, um, we killed a bunch of them. Oh, dear. See, the problem is that Sledgehammer is really slow. Craps. Alright, we did pick up a stim pack though, right? Okay, that will heal us up a little bit, even if we are now going to be thirsty. We're just going to have to put up with that. Um, did any ghouls drop anything useful? No. Well, um, I guess we can go check out where all the ghouls were now that we've killed a bunch of them. Ooh, wonder glue. I will take that. Uh, hmm. Why does that bell keep ringing? It's kind of worrying. I don't want to think of it. Where is that bell? Oh, it's on a boy. Okay, that's fine. Are these empty? These are not empty, are they? Nope. These are all full of beer. Except that one. There we go. We had a couple empty bottles. Aha! We might be able to quench our thirst. Should be good. Let's fill up some bottles. There we go. You're no longer thirsty. This boat is completely empty. There's not even a steering wheel. Scavengers, man. Alright, well, uh, this, I feel, is probably a good place to call it for, uh, for the episode. We're not exactly in a great place. Certainly not as good as we were when we started. Um, but we're not dead, so things are looking up. Anyways, that's all for today. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.